From small animals to large, taking care of everything from turtles to killer whales, it's not an easy job for the veterinary staff at SeaWorld. Yes, but it's a task that is made possible by an all-female team of veterinarian and technicians. And we wondered what it's like on a daily basis for them. So News 6 at 9's Carolina Cardona went out to check out the behind-the-scenes part of this team. Hey guys, we are inside the surgical room here at SeaWorld. This is where the animals have to come to, whether it's for a routine checkup or a major surgery. Now, who are the women that are in charge of keeping those animals healthy? Here's a look into each one of their stories. All of us work on every single animal in this park. It's a joy to work with this um, group, of, group of women, and it really makes me look forward to coming into work every single day. The women here are wonderful. They're very passionate women. They are super intelligent, um, and they all, we all have our strengths, and we all complement each other's weaknesses. This is the A-Team at SeaWorld Orlando, and they're all women. Meeting them, I found them very engaging, and I found a cooperative work environment, and so that was the most important thing to me. They each have a unique story. Almost all knew at a young age what they wanted to be. Dr. Erlika Reed was five when she discovered she wanted to work with sea animals. Dr. Lindemann was 13 when she made that life choice. When I discovered that you could use veterinary skills to work with animals and especially marine animals, I decided that that was the way to go. The story for Dr. Duraco was a little different. She had plans of becoming a lawyer. But her love for animals was stronger. After college, she worked at SeaWorld San Diego. I worked very closely with the veterinarians, and I absolutely loved the rescue and rehab program. And that's what inspired me to go to veterinary school. Dr. Martoni is now doing her residency at SeaWorld. At just four years old, her passion was awakened. That was a very defining moment in my life. My parents provided me the opportunity to, to go to SeaWorld as a young child. And so that's where I fell in love with dolphins. Thousands of animals depend on on their care. We can check their reproductive health. One of the wonderful things about the animals that live here is that they all are trained to participate in their own health care. They're trained to give us a blood sample or trained to give us a urine sample or trained for voluntary ultrasound. Not only are they a team of professionals, they've become a sisterhood of veterinarians. I hope that we can inspire a lot of young girls that are interested in this field. Do what you love, do your passion. Don't be afraid to, to be the smart girl. Carolina Cardona, News 6 at 9. Don't be afraid to be the smart girl. Exactly. What a great message. Yeah, I love that. And vet school students who are in their senior year, they can partake in externships, which allow them to spend four to six weeks at zoological parks like SeaWorld. That's great. And what a great team, you know. It's, just, mm -hmm. it's very much that, that STEM program, that science, technology. You think about it, it's all that wrapped into one right here in Central Florida. Right in the backyard. Yeah.